Hello, this is a tutorial especially for AMD graphics card users, but I am using an NVIDIA graphics card and I'm noticing a better frame time and overall frame rate. Like right here in this area, I can't really get 60 FPS before the changes. And after the changes, I can maintain 60 most of the time. Now, first thing we need to do is to go to this GitHub link right here. I'll leave it in the video description. Go to the latest version. Right now it's 2.4.1, but it might be different in the future. So what we need to do is scroll down all the way to the bottom after clicking the last version. Then we download the following file right here. The first one, uh, once it's done downloading, I'm just going to go to the downloads folder, then drag this uh, archive here to the desktop. And if your Windows um, can't really open it like this, just straight away, you just download a, um, a s software that can do so. I would suggest 7-Zip. Uh, you can just Google it right like this and go to this download right here, the first one. And after you install it, I'm not going to install it right now because I already have it. Then you just right click the um, archive and go extract then do the same thing for the extracted uh, archive but now since I can just access it like this uh, we'll go to the x64 folder then we go to where the game is installed now this might be different for you now for me it's located in the this drive right here the games folder then Assassin's Creed Origins folder and it's right here this is the folder we need but if you have the game on Steam, the folder is going to be like this on the C drive, and it's going to be in the program files 86. Then you scroll down to Steam folder. Inside Steam folder, you're going to find a folder called Steam Apps, and then the folder we need is going to be in the common folder. So, what we need to do here is to drag and drop all these files right here to where the game's executable file is located. And then after that, we go to the games executable, which is this right here. Then right click properties, compatibility, and make sure this option disable full screen optimization is checked. And that's it. Now, once we launch the game, you can notice that it's running in the Vulkan API. If you have something to check, like the MSI Afterburner, and the game should run much better. So, hope this helps you and peace out.